County from school districts all over the county join members of local law enforcement to shoot out windows today. The reason behind the demonstration while well, to test which glass can withstand a bullet. KCBD News Channel 11 Cindy Lowther tells us about the levels of resistant glass and finds out which one could best help save lives. On March 27, 2023, Audrey Hale shot the entry glass door of a private Christian school in Nashville, Tennessee, 11 times and gained entry, then killed three children and three adults. The entrance doors are always going to be the first place that they attack. CEO of Guardian Security Ray Dunn says they created these designs to slow down the entry of an intruder or keep the intruder out completely. It's to stop the threat outside of the school. Uh, Winded protection could keep the bad guy out. The demonstration starts with the first glass pane. Director of Security Ian Bannister says this pane delays entry for up to two minutes before bullets will shatter the glass and rip the film. The 16 mil film is designed to delay entry into a building. It will not stop ballistic um, attacks and it will only slow down a perpetrator trying to enter a building. The next system tested is the Defense Light Pro, designed to keep intruders out, but bullets can still come in. But it will stop any manner of hand weapons. It can be attacked ballistically and still survive and perform as intended, but the rounds will still pass through. The final system tested is Bullet Shield. Made of layers of polycarbonate, this pane can stop all handgun bullets from passing, though it is not made to withstand an assault rifle. The guns were fired at the standard testing range of 16.4 feet. At that distance, the rounds escaping the weapon reach their max velocity on target. That gives you the most penetration, the hardest test to pass. If you These know. windows are offered to schools and law enforcement buildings to help protect in the event of an active shooter. Although it is unclear whether or not it will be installed here in Lubbock. Yeah, no failures. Yeah. Sydney Lowther, KCBD, News Channel 11.